You set up a Wi-Fi network in your home, but now you want to get online in the back bedroom or upstairs. So in this episode of Upgrade Your Life, the easiest and most cost-effective ways to extend the range of your wireless network. First, the free fixes. If you only need a few more feet of range, try lifting your wireless router higher. The signal has an easier time traveling down than up. Usually that's because there's less interference from physical barriers, stuff that gets in the way, like furniture. And speaking of interference, your Wi-Fi range may be limited if you and your neighbor have routers operating on the same channel. You can use this nifty web utility to see if that's a problem. Now for the big expansions. Upstairs, through thick walls, or over longer distances in your home. First, check your router and see if after the funky 802.11 number, it says B or G. If so, it might be time for an upgrade. Newer N routers have about twice the range of those B or G ones and can cost as little as $30. If you already have an N router and you want even more range, well then a $70 Wi-Fi extender can help. Just put it within range of your main access point or your wireless router and it bounces the signal out to remote wireless devices, theoretically doubling your range. But if you have a room far away from your existing router, you have two other choices. String cable or use something called home power line networking. It sounds crazy. But you buy this $60 adapter kit, plug it into your internet connection here, and then plug it into the wall. Then from any other plug in your house, you pick that internet access up with another adapter that just plugs into the electrical outlet. From here, you can set up another Wi-Fi network or hardwire into an Xbox, a computer, or a printer. Hey, thanks for watching. For Yahoo News, I'm Becky Worley.